I damn little toy too. This shit's awesome. I know you get that right there. I got um. I've been I, I man. Fuck. I actually got some wild shit in this week, man. Um. Oh yeah. Let me pull that real quick. I just got something in one. One of the things I got in, I most definitely wanted. Oh, I got it right here. It's RPM forty. I know it's purple and shit, but fuck it. I got it from EJB out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? This right here is legit. I really wanted the RPM 40. It was between, well, it wasn't even a between. Well, there was a split moment there was a between. There was the fetch and, well, there was this fetch and then there was the RPM 40. So, hey, hey, what's going on, people? Oh, damn, everybody's coming. That's what the fuck. Hey, 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 dude, man. So yeah, it was between the RPM 40 and the um the fetch kit. But I already knew that the RPM 40 was the best thing to get because you had the two pods. And um one of them takes a certain type of coils and the other one takes the normal coils, which is I know most definitely was that come that which I was concerned about because I was gonna be using the Nord coil. And then they had the rebuildable, which I'm not gonna be using, so fuck that shit. Um, I ain't even get the rebuildable because I saw Jay Hayes review on it. It did that was actually a turnoff to see that shit, but the RPM 40 is legit. Um, I'm rocking 25 milligram um, salt nick in the bit. Uh, I'm rocking some of the bad drip. Hey. The RPM 40 is the best way to go, beauty. Which thing, that thing, it, it, it was the best way to go. Even though it's purple, even though it's purple, it rocks for sure. It rocks for sure. I got to tell you, one of the main things I wasn't a big, big fan of, I thought I wasn't going to, well, I knew I was not going to be a big fan of was like duck bill, kind of like, you know what I'm saying, mouthpiece right here. But yo, it's actually legit. You can both definitely chuck a cloud with this on some goddamn salt, Nick. Let me see. I think I was using that 20 watts. What's going on, zero? Cool. Let's, let's do 20 watts on it. That right there was actually 26 watts. That was 26 watts. You see that cloud on Salt Nick? That is kind of some crazy shit. All right. You know, crazy yeah, like me, both definitely can rock that purple, Christian. Oh, shit. Yeah, damn it. I just thought about it. But hey, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? That ain't got nothing to do with this situation. That, that, that situation is dead. This one is alive. Well, <laughs> no, that is, that right there. Uh, shout out to my homie Brent over there at Island Bait because he was the one. Yeah, this um, direct lung. This is direct lung. This is direct along. Um, I don't see um, any airflow adjustment on this, but you most definitely can check the cloud. <laughs> um, I got to tell you, this is my first device that I've actually been able to do this with. Even these same dual Nord, Nord coils, um, I would have put this like in my um, my smock a little smock stick, and um, I wouldn't be able to do that with this shit. So it was, it most definitely is kind of crazy to me how I am able to do this with the same coils that I was using on a different device. Um, but it is nice, again, you do get two pods, so one you can use the free base, and one you can use the regular. Hey, Chris, what the fuck are you doing? I don't see a dick and shit. I'm talking bitch. <laughs> Had my cartridge behind the computer monitor. <laughs> so, um, let me see. Uh, Rob Freeman. Where, where Rob Freeman? And oh, the, shit. And the Vinci. Hey, Robin. Okay, I got it right there. I have the RPM and the Vinci. Yeah, my, my live chat wasn't set up just that quick. Um, honestly, I never seen, I haven't seen the Vinci. I haven't seen the Vinci. But to me, the RPM was like a no-brainer. It was honestly like a no-brainer. I don't think, I don't know if that, I didn't try to see if this other quill would fit in the other pod, but just to have two pods, just to have the option of having two pods, and um, you know, so I got my free base in this one, I have my salt nick in this one, I can easily just do this shit, boom, pop this in, I ain't gotta do no extra little button adjustments and no type of shit, 
I'm ready to rock. Got to adjust the wattage up a little bit, but it's nice. It's really a nice device for the fucking price, man. Like, I can sit back and rant and rave about this little motherfucker, but this was the one I was going to get. This was the device I was going to get. It was between this um, and there was something else. Smock actually came out with a DNA, but the fetch actually beat every spec over the DNA, even though it was just the DNA. What is that, Griff? Da Vinci. <clears throat> kind of cool. I ain't in the pods, but I, I just like all the fucking lights. Oh, yep, the voo-poo. The voo-poo. Yeah. So let me go back real quick and see um, what... Robin, so which one did you like more, the um, the Vinci or the uh, the RPM? Because they both, they both definitely do... They cater each other. They both look like the same shit. Mm -hmm. But Da Vinci got a, like um, the mouthpiece look a little bit different. One that affects the way it hit. Oh, shit, I hit the wrong one. Shit, I'm, why don't you hit the wrong one? Check that one out. I uh, think this is. There we go right there. All right, so why the fuck? Goddamn coupon code. Let me see real quick. So only got an hour. The stream will be ending at 7.30 tonight. We got some shit to do out this bitch. All right, so it's a 1500 mile. The mouthpiece does look a lot better. Um, let me see, manual and auto modes. I'm not really giving a fuck about that shit, yo. Uh, let me see, I see variable voltage. Variable voltage pod system. Um, All right, so one thing about this though is them coils. Um, there you go again, the gene chip. <laughs> she says she loves them both. Um, I haven't tried the Nord tank. Hey, what's going on, E man? So let me go to the um, Nord tank. This is the Nord. Well, um, this is the free base tank. This is the free base tank. The juice I'm using in this, I don't know if anybody has um, had this, the lemon arm. It is a phenomenal lemon. Um, it's okay, uh, but it's basically like a lemon blend. Uh, like I would say like a lemon head blend, but really subtle, really, really subtle. It's not like you're gonna be getting that harsh uh, lemon type taste. It's really light on the lemon. I wanna say it's like um, a nice lemonade, just not sweet as shit, not harsh as a son of a bitch. It's really kind of like light on the lemon note. Um, so it's not going to be flowery or no type of shit like that. It's, it's really going to be for someone um, that's liking just a nice lemon taste, not a whole lot. Um, but I don't know who else has had these motherfuckers right here. Pop these. <coughs> oh, yeah. So this is a peppermint. This is a peppermint one. And this, I guess, is a strawberry one. These are available at uh, premium base supply. And especially the nom noms. The nom noms are from, uh, boom, yo, yo, zero. You beat me to it, B. You beat me to it. You beat me to it. <laughs> that, the, um, the cactus jackfruit. Bro, what is this right here in front of my face? Right here. They've been on it right now. You know what I'm saying? The cactus jackfruit the, with the cactus jackfruit with the meridian orange. This one right here is legit. This one right here is legit. And they also have a cherry lime with a ginger. That one's legit. That one's legit. And when it comes to blends, for me, when I saw the regular ones, you got a grape, uh, a watermelon, a, a strawberry, I think it was, and the lemon. But the X2s are the ones that's different. You got the uh, jackfruit, the cactus, and the meridian, um, the white peach, and the raspberry. Uh, but to me, I like the X2s. The best ones is the cactus jackfruit and the um, this cherry lime ginger. Those joints right there is popping. The other ones, they're just like, you know, some regular blends for those that just want something that's like subtle. Not a whole lot boasting on the flavor. Um, but they were okay for, for those that didn't do that type of shit. Me, I like that extra shit. I, I would rather take some uh, bad lemon drip in my tank because I know I'm going to be getting that robust type lemon shit. It's really, it's just really sour. 
What's going on, boo? You high as shit. Look at my How all CBD? They don't believe it's happening. They said it wasn't possible, baby. You I ain't fucking. I tell you this, I ain't fucking with no melatonin tonight out of this bitch. I am. <laughs> I don't want. Hey, popcorn. God, you got the popcorn, man. I ain't get the pop. I ain't, you know, I ain't had the popcorn, man. I ain't had that all the bites for the treat. Have I seen the Mac Life Ma? I have seen the Mac Life Ma, job, and um, I was thinking about it, but I was like, man, I'm gonna go with the RPM forty. I mean, between that and the RPM forty, the the rebuildable situation on that one will definitely on the rebuildable situation on the Mac Life is what is really the hype to it on me. You know, 18650 battery, you know, you got the uh the rebuildable section on that. And if I was correct, it had a replaceable 510 drip to just in case you didn't like the drip that it came on and shit. So I thought that was legit. And I think it is a nice device for those that are into something like that. Um, you know, that's kind of like sparing off from wanting to get a pillar box and being a part of the pillar box crew or just being a regular individual. You know, like it is tall as shit. That was one of the downsides of the characteristics, but Look at the build. Look how it's built. You got the battery at the bottom. You know what I'm saying? You got the tank at the top. Now, if they would have did some kind of like crazy, you know, like tank type situation where the tank was all differently kind of like shaped and shit, then that would have made things look another fucking type of way. And people possibly wouldn't have liked that shit at the end of the day. So, you know, that's what they went for. It might not be a hell of a lot of a hit, but a good amount of people are going to get this shit. Mm-hmm. It'd be about a good thousand or two that's gonna get that shit for sure. Yeah, crack this jackfruit is amazing. Had it last year at the expo, so good. Hey, what's going on, fish, bro? What's up, y'all? What's up, Chris? What it do, fish? Mm. Yeah, you know, it's a little Friday night. I had to come over here and chill with the goddamn squad, all right? You know what I'm saying? Two chains making it do what it do, man. But, a lot of things is going. I got a lot of shit. A lot of shit. Seen um Sundiata um got his chains all polished up, man. You keep him shiny on that scooter, bro. <laughs> keep him shiny on the head, man. Oh man, Sundiata <laughs> gonna move out there. I tell you this. <coughs> since I saw that, since I saw that segment on how to roll a backwood, and I knew that a lot of people did not know about this shit. Now, a good amount of people knew about the shit, but you believe that a lot of people did not know about the shit. A lot of people didn't know about the shit. Mitch was even like, bro, how did you, how, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm rolling up. He's like, what? You know, even when I'm showing, I show my baby mom, she was like, what? You know, she was like, she never, she's a smoker. She never seen that shit before. You know what I'm saying? So I had to do that segment, y'all. I had to do that. And you know, like, when you learn, it, it's like to me, when you learn something new and me being in the, Type of situation I am recording this, you know, all that fucking time, you know. Why not? But this is the fuck I do, you know what I'm saying? And people might like the way I bring it to them versus that other motherfucker and shit. So it is what it, it is. May, it may take you a half hour to roll the damn blunt, but you do a nice job. Hey, man, <laughs> hey, I hate it. Man, I used to have to do that shit back in the day. <laughs> he oh, need, oh, he need a pack of these, Vu. Don't even need them. Don't even need them. All I need is uh, this right here. I got, I got them. <laughs> All I need is this right here, man. And my thing is, that's what he really need. Yeah, right here, this right here. There you go. Here you go. Here you go. I ain't, you I ain't need to just hook up with the with the old Happy Blaze box, folks. They yeah. send <laughs> that shit, cones, papers, and all that shit. Oh, good. All, hey, look, mine. I ain't even got to buy no extra shit at the goddamn store. Just give me the pack of backwoods. I take them all out and roll them. That bit. That's it. Come out nice, nice, man. What? It's like, God damn. Been doing this shit for all these fucking years, and then just boom, things just automatically change out here. Just in a fucking snap of a fucking thing. Mm. Right. <laughs> I bought two back of backwoods just to celebrate of the goddamn shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I still dab like a motherfucker, but you best believe I keep my greenery sucker. You know, oh, this right here is um. Ooh, Look at this big motherfucker. Damn. Like a fucking mustache. <laughs> I ain't got no big buzz like that, but these buzz are very some really nice buzz, but hold on. That's like my shit I got right now. It's not big buds, but it's tasty and fucking stout. Yeah. 
Really? Matter of fact, I actually got another. My, my THC percentages ain't where y'all are at, but I mean, it's still fun. <laughs> <laughs> I got a segment on this right here, the Lumba. Oh, shit. I actually called it Lumba. <laughs> <laughs> it's like this right here. I never, I never heard of this shit before. I ain't never heard of this shit before. Close and guess, hey, and matter of fact, why well, I got him right here over there. Hey, hey, Chris, but it's funny. Guess who I got this shit from? Who? Zoe. <laughs> I went up. She's like, I just got this. I can't even find hey. it. No way. <laughs> hey, we're going to talk after the show. I got I got somebody else I want you to meet. All right. So, yeah, this right here is. Uh, me. It's put Zoe to shame. Sorry. I hate to say it. This right here is uh this right here is pretty good. This right here is pretty good. I mean, I always get different things though. I don't just get one thing. You know, I always have different things. But you know, uh, I it might be different because when I go, I get a lot of shit. That's uh, that's only disadvantage. That, that ones and twosy type shit. You know what I'm saying? I want I want eight hundred one k type shit. You know what I'm saying? You mean put a little more fuckers on a little shit? I got people that want it. See, my shit down here, the dude's only got one kind at a time, but it's never bad. You know what I mean? But so I at least I got that life. going for it. I <laughs> wifey, just, uh, wifey just touched down in Georgia, sent me this shit. <laughs> What's that, an edible? Nah, some bud. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I guess she went to one of the dispensaries out there. I said that didn't take long. She said, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> I had to get it. Where's my goddamn thing at, man? So, yo, my my favorite mods right now, um, man, like my my agent's actually like this. He's staying on deck right now, yo. The agent's actually staying on deck. This and the, this and my Jackaroo are my two top devices. These what tank is that? Huh? What tank is that? Uh, this is the um Kylie. I see you fish right. Oh, the Ky- oh, That's some red hairs. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> the TAC looking good. The, the, the CBD looking fantastic out there, bitch. God damn, man. Y'all take y'all picking with y'all fucking. Hey, man, fuck that shit. I'm about to dab it out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be that rowdy, rowdy. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to get it on for throwing it down and let's get it going. I didn't get to bring my rig with me this week. I had to leave it at the house. Hey, sometimes it's like that, dude. You know yeah, saying? it's like that sometimes. <laughs> let it rest like it's a Sunday at its best. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and get this. But oh, oh, hold, hold the fuck up, yo, hold the fuck up. First and foremost, shout out to everybody that is subscribed to Food TV and watching that shit over there, big. You know what I'm saying? Fucking with me. And um, if you ain't subscribed to that goddamn shit, there's the link down below. Click that motherfucking goddamn show and get your ass on over there, ho. God damn it, you know what I'm saying? I'm making, <laughs> and I'm gonna tell you now because I do not know, you know, um, because of all the old shit that um, a lot of my old content the way I had did things on this channel with links and all this other kind of shit. And sometimes I'm hearing right now people are getting hit from content that they had put up a while ago. Some people are doing new shit. Jay Hayes, I think, got hit over a fucking coil or something like that. I don't fucking know, Jack. So um, I'm trying to be cautious, most definitely. Even like with the cured bomb desserts, I had put cured CBD desserts, cured CBD desserts, because I wasn't getting my goddamn can of pool off no fucking shit again. Fuck with them, man. But again, sometimes these companies, of course, don't know what the fuck is going on here with the YouTube scenario. But anyway, yeah, I got the Foolish Fucking TV over there. Um, whole different, you know, I, to me it is actually different type of content. It's not review shit. It's not review shit. It's actually totally different type of content. Stories and all that good little shit, you know what I'm saying? So um, I, I actually like the stories. I actually like the stories, you know what I'm saying? These are real fucking stories. And I got another one. The one where I saved the dude's life, I got that coming out. I just recorded <laughs> that one today. I forgot to do that one last week, but I got that one coming, that punk motherfucker. I ain't even heard from the son of a bitch, you know what I'm saying? But it's okay, though, you know what I'm saying? It was all about the saving the goddamn life and shit. But anyway, yeah, follow Foolish Motherfucking TV the goddamn day. Got the link down below. Get that shit rocking and popping. It's called Foolish TV, baby. Hey, Foolish TV. It's, it's, it's my TV. You know what I'm saying? It's only me. You know what I'm saying? No bitches out here in these streets. I don't need them. You know what I'm saying? If they ain't helping pay to make the situation possible, you know what I'm saying? They ain't help. They ain't helped by the goddamn camera, then bitch, you won't be on it. I dig that shit. I watch it. It's good shit. Yeah, hey, I appreciate it, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to bring in more different. <laughs> We always see vape shit. I mean, it's you know, it's okay to have other content out there besides vape shit. Yeah, it's the other the other part of the shit that I do like. You know what I'm exactly. saying? Exactly. I make it a little bit more interesting. Huh? I, I like the it. intro. 
<laughs> ain't got no gas in it. <laughs> bitch ain't got no gas. Hey, we make we making it happen. And I was most, like, even when I had did that, you know, like I did the um, yeah, yeah you know what I'm saying? Link the cotton. That's right. Jay had a link the cotton, and he got a fucking channel strike for link for cotton. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't got time for that shit, man. I ain't got time for. It. Um, I'm just doing the best way. I'm just kind of most like, when I hear and see shit like that transpire. Um, you know, I'm glad that. It didn't happen to me, and I know how to move kind of like accordingly. Hope I was gonna get high to get that goddamn shit, but if it happens, then it happens out this bitch. But damn, a link to cotton? Damn. They, don't, they ain't playing around with cotton these days. Ever since that movie, <laughs> Get Out. <laughs> Ever since that whole metaphoric situation, they ain't playing around here on YouTube, baby. Uh, I mean, it's, it's, I'll be honest with you, it's, it's just gonna keep getting worse. Anyone that's in the vape stuff is you're running the risk. You're running the risk, man. But that's why I say most definitely, man, like follow the food of CV because even over there, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what if the shit pop off over here, then I you know how to still find my ass over there. You know what I'm saying? And even with my newer with, with my um newer videos that I will be doing, um like starting next week, I'm gonna try to remember to you know remind motherfuckers, hey look, click the link down below and check out the motherfucking shit for sure. Subscribe to that goddamn shit because remember what happened last time out this bitch. Hey, foolish man, like you deleted your channel. What would you do? I didn't even know you were still doing. People are still popping up right now saying, cuz I didn't know you were still in. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just because the other channel got deleted, you know what I'm saying? Doesn't mean you stop shit out of this bitch, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, you got things rocking and popping, man. Damn, this goddamn bag was so fucking sticky, it got stuck to the fucking bucket. <laughs> shit. Come on up off of here real quick. I want to take one. Ooh, that should come up out of like a volcano. <laughs> All right. Cheers to that Modern Warfare 3, bitches. <laughs> shit, I'd be taking a dab in my CBD shit, but... All them damn coil heads I got for all them little fucking dab, <laughs> dab rigs are fucking dark. Shit. <laughs> I'm okay. That fucking cough is so fucking funny. Well, I'll just continue to stuff my cone. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, are those the white papers or are those the fucking organic hemp? Uh, those look like the knockoff ones, Chris. <laughs> he even uses clone papers. Yeah, clone sheets and shit. Woo! <laughs> 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 Yeah, if you look over there, he over there packing that shit. I don't take my dad on the house, motherfucker. All that. Just that. <laughs> you, almost, you almost died. Too. <laughs> 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 yeah, done. Yeah, that's like that's like making raw papers now. <laughs> you know, nobody does it though. I mean, not everybody does it though. You know what I'm saying? Like, Missy he doesn't cough like shit. Uh, Brent, he be holding his shit in about to pass out in the fucking chair, you know, like, <laughs> like, where he look? I be playing my game and shit, and I be looking over him. <coughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Face is red as this goddamn lighter. What the fuck? <laughs> but it is always a good signal for I know that he just took a dab and all that good old shit. Oh man. It's kind of like a deadlift. If you don't hold it for a second at the top, it don't count. <laughs> yeah, I got I got them cold spark lungs, you know what I'm saying? Like starting the engine up cold outside. <laughs> Gotta choke it a little bit. <laughs> <coughs> but, drink some water. Mm. <laughs> it, 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 it's still gonna do the same thing. I'm still gonna do the same thing. I, I tried that before. That's weird. And see, for this reason, my kids are in public school, man. I'm sorry. 
I love it though, man. I love it. That is the ventilation of it. You know what I'm saying? You got that shit turned up too high. No, I don't. I got it turned up just the right amount. So what I do is there are two ways that I do it now. When I first was doing this shit, I was just doing it. And even when I was like, you know what I'm saying, using it, no one was actually telling me when to actually stop. You know what I'm saying? But trying to find out when to stop is actually your ass to know when the fuck to stop. So, <laughs> didn't know. I went over to the fucking dude house and I hit off his rig and he was like, yeah, just take it till you can't take no more. So I was hitting off the fucking rig and I'm like, well, when the fuck is, am I supposed to stop? So I just kept going until like I couldn't inhale no more. But by that time, man, that shit, he was like, whoa. It was like back grab. <laughs> it was boom, boom, boom. Oh man, I was out that motherfucking house in his backyard. He looked in and jumped in his fucking pool. I bullshit you not, man. My fucking shit was on fire. Now that was my heart. That was like my harshest hit ever in my fucking life. And that was off some fucking sauce with the diamonds. That shit fucked me up. What's up, Tony? Man. Was that with the traditional rig where you heat it with the torch? Yeah. Yeah. That's I always true. find those are harsher than the shit, the electric shit. Nah, fuck that. Tell you. Fuck that. Is this somebody I know? They better. Yeah. That was um uh uh that was, yeah, be more mm-hmm. man yo he had but see honestly fish fry to me that is I like that better mm-hmm. because you know hitting it off of that is a little bit to me a little bit more better. You know, the e the, the, the carter to me, honestly, I love my fucking car. You know, like I think mm-hmm. if I still I think if I had a dad rig, it would go to waste because I would you know what I'm saying? Still be using this at the end of the day. You know, your dad, a lot of times the dad rig, I would just let that motherfucker stay where it is. I ain't got time to keep moving that motherfucker over here and all that good little shit. But look, this little motherfucker, boom. That's yeah. it. This battery can go dead. I can put this motherfucker on the charger and it's done charging before the stream is over with. I can be yeah. right back in dad with you guys before the stream is over with. You know what I mean? now, You now, know that MIG rig's like that too. It charges quick as shit. Yeah, the MIG rig charges quick as well. But it's like an internal battery type situation, so that it doesn't, they, it doesn't take long with it. They know us potheads don't want to be waiting for a long ass time for it to charge. <laughs> that puffco, man, that puffco took like four fucking hours. My fucking camera battery to charge quicker than that motherfucker. That's just ridiculous. And again, if you're using that at the highest wattage on that, then you're burning out that battery like quicker, just as you're doing with this right here. If I use it at level four. Which is the highest? It is going to burn these two eighteen three fifties out real quick. You know, mm-hmm. um, I ain't going to get as much power off of it, and as battery life I would if I would use it on level two, just like with your regular vape device. If you use mm-hmm. it at the highest wattage, the battery life is not going to use. It's not going to last you all day. But if you use it at a you know lower wattage, then you're going to have way more battery life than the next guy. Okay, so, but even with that, you know. Um, if you are a, a, a person that takes that likes them high temp dabs, then you feel when the battery goes dead, you can quickly charge it out here. You know, like that card is the shit, man. I fuck with it. And the paper pots on this cheaper shit, that's my motherfucking advice on this bitch. Um, but yeah, what else I got? Um, I had a thing come up on my feed the other day for Puffco on Instagram where they got some kind of new glass piece that goes on it. It's supposed to hold more water and. They got a couple of them. They got, well, actually they came out with the customs. I didn't even know they had custom ones on their site, but they got custom ones on their site. Um, the motherfuckers are expensive. They are expensive. They are honestly more expensive than if you can get a, a traditional glass bowl to probably make your shit for you and make it a lot cheaper. But that shit is expensive. Like $400 and above. Damn. $400. But now, honestly, that's not heavy expensive as like some of these rigs that's running around the same price. But you can get a bad rig, you know, like you can get the glass for like 50 bucks, a good little piece of glass for like 50 bucks. And then, um, you know, your quartz bucket is what the profit costs you the most. I mean, cost, you can get a quartz bucket and the bucket will cost you more than the fucking rig itself. <laughs> <laughs> and it's kind of fun. The funny part about it is, you know, I ain't no shit about that shit. You know what I'm saying? Maybe like four months ago, I just been. But I gotta try this fucking little fetch kit. I don't even I don't even know what it looks like. What is it? Yes. Um the fetch kit. 
by Smock. Hmm. Uh. Which, I mean, like. They got it over at premium? Nah, this came from EJV when I got, when the um, RPM 40 came in. Oh, okay. What is this? You get one mesh coil, one triple coil. But see, I really want, I just really like this. I honestly, I, you know, this right here is, a, you know, I don't, I don't know. I See, Smog just be trying to capitalize like shit, man. Ain't <laughs> that nothing new? <laughs> you know, just be trying to cap, because like the RPM 40 is really the shit. RPM 40 is like, you know what I'm saying? Like everyone's going to go and get the RPM 40. Everyone's going to get the RPM 40. Like the fetch kit, you know, why would I go and get the fetch kit when I get the RPM 40 and it has two pods and all that good little shit? Like, that's one, that's why I got to like really see. Hold on. They're gonna, come out with a, 40, they're gonna come out with the 45, they're gonna come out with the 50. This honestly, I'm gonna tell you one thing. I didn't know this device had a screen. What's going on, Rissa? And Josh Rhodes. And let me see something real quick. I did not know this device had a screen, to be honest with you. I ain't even well, like, you do. Now I see that melatonin kicking in on your ass too. <laughs> There's a lot kicking in there. Oh, I got a little screen. And if I had to compare the screens. Not fucking hung over as shit from that Hispanic Halloween party we had last night. <laughs> Fuck my ass up. Comparing the screens. They are the same thing. Same thing, same thing. So the only thing that will be different with this is, you know, the little pod. That has a nice, now this does has a nice magnetic snap to it. Does have a nice magnetic snap. Let me see something. Why the fucking, fat, why the fucking hole gotta be so big? You know what I'm saying? Like, can't fit in it. Is it this right here? Both same screens and all that good little shit, but honestly, right now, I would go to RPM40. I don't know how much the fetch kit is running. I gotta look at the price tag on that. I do like these orange panels. I do like these panels. I like these panels. This is nice. I like the panels. I mean, look like an orange fucking tangerine, to tell you the truth. Uh, where is this thing at? <laughs> God <Eat> damn it. <laughs> Yeah, honestly, I ain't know it had a little screen on it. It doesn't show a screen no way, just like, you know what I'm saying, from the side, I guess the highlight of this device is the goddamn panels itself. <laughs> hey, and if you just now joining this goddamn shit, make sure you subscribe to Foolish TV out this bitch. Yeah, so back down, man. Oh, I've done the wrong goddamn spot. I will, oh, stream ends in 30 minutes, my friends. Yeah, I gotta let you guys know. I gotta hold, I gotta do, I, make it. I ain't even gonna lie to you motherfuckers and shit. Me and my team gotta do some Call of Duty out of this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers, I paid me a lot of goddamn money for this shit out here in these streets. And ain't nobody gonna get this goddamn shit. So goddamn it, what the fuck I want to. Huh? Is that that new one, the uh, Modern Warfare? You damn skip it. And I'm playing with my friends on PS4, so we all in this motherfucker. <laughs> we all in the winning camp. Hey, now, for those that checked out the test screen the other day, y'all got my ass kicked, okay? I got my ass kicked. There's no denying that shit. They kicked my ass like son of a man. Yo. I seen the replay. You got fucked up. Fuck, fuck up. <laughs> now, I did see another way. Um, now, I was doing a test screen of trying to, like, just do something. I, because it's not like I was, like, switching. it's not like I'm switching in gaming, you know what I'm saying? But... As I'm doing my game and shit, I'm always a lot of times, that's when I'm doing my samplers and shit. So I was like, you know, I always wanted to 
be able to just sit over here and chill and shit for a little time period, you know, even if it's for like an hour or two while I am gaming, you know, and, you know, just do that little scenario. So, um, I, there's always like, you got to capture card and all that good little shit. So I was trying to find a different little way to make things happen. Now I found out, uh, I, all I had to do is minimize the screen a little bit and then it'll be a little bit more, um, it'll, the, the screen will be a little bit more uh, consistent. It won't be like uh, buffering and shit. So the lag was a little bit of an issue in the beginning, but I fixed it at the end. But I wanted to most be, I wanted to be a little more crisper, and at the same time want the audio. So I'm gonna try another scenario tomorrow, because um, I'm using Mixer to. That's how you gotta broadcast the shit from the Xbox and shit through the mix out of this bitch. So I'm gonna, you know, what I'm saying, try another little method. I was trying out the. That's when I was trying out these goddamn nom nom. Shit, I ain't know it was gonna be two, four, six, eight, nine of them bitches. <laughs> yes. God damn. Man, now Clarissa had told me about what's going on, Shane? Hello, Bill, man. I had Clarissa had told me about these when they um when she had tried them at the expo. And she was saying that the lemon junk was like the best of the best. So I was like, damn, I can't wait to try this shit out, you know. And they just so have they came available over here, premium bait. And um they sent they sent them to me to try out. And um, I was like, the first one I had to go to was the women. I was like, it wasn't really a whole lot to write about. I, was, you know, I wasn't like it was extra sweetness and shit. You know, it wasn't like it was popping off with lemons and shit. You know, like shit. I was actually eating some lemon heads while, you know, what I'm saying vaping that shit. You know, give it a little bit extra kick. But they were like subtile flavors for the. But I think that the grape one was a little bit more had a little more flavor to it. Um. But they, I guess, was subtitle. Um, if you've had the like the ruthless grape drink, then I want to say it was just a tad bit below, like on the ruthless grape drink, how strong on the flavor note it was. Um, but yeah, they were okay. They were okay. The X twos would have been the best at the end of the day, and that would have been this uh, cactus grapefruit with the meridian and the cherry lime ginger. That ginger. Most definitely, Joe. That would throw a motherfucker off. Like, a mother, I'm not vaping no goddamn ginger cut. Cut. First, you came in with the fucking rose pepper. Now you're talking about vaping ginger. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you, B? Like, but nah, like, which I know, like, you gotta try this shit. That, the, the, uh, that cherry lime with the ginger, they put that together very well. They put that together very well. And I love when a blend is put together like that. Even though, it's you know um well it is not the top of the line. Well, the top one to me was the cactus grapefruit with the meridian because like you know I, I like this one because this was my favorite. Hey, fuck it too. You know. But that cherry lime with the ginger, that joint was good though. They did a good job with that one. This is a surprising blend, and I like blends like that because those are type of blends where it's though you know you want to try out something that's different. Um, they had a good little price tag. You know, if you got some shit out here that motherfuckers are creating, and you got to pay like you know fifty dollars for that shit. Wolf Bang did that shit, man. And actually, what Wolf Bang did with that in um, Dead Man's Hands, well, Dead Man's Hands is what it is now. Like, that is a real cultural blend. That shit is like, it's, just, it's crazy. Matter of fact, I got some of that shit. Fuck that, man. I got to get Vince to give me some of that shit because he got, he, he got it over there at his shop and shit. I got to get some of that. I ain't had it in a minute, but it's, it's not for everybody. Because that shit is a coil gunker. <laughs> that shit is a coil fucking gunker. But let me tell you, that shit is most definitely culturistic. It's different. It's not like any other have, any other things that you have done had. It's not going to look like this. It's not going to look like this. It's it's different. But that's the kind of honestly to me, that's the kind of shit that I would be like in store for for the future. That's something I would like to go to a like a vape cafe and vape different culturistic shit like this. Vape a bourbon blend, a uh, bourbon cheesecake, a uh, uh, a bomb as fuck fruity pebble cheesecake. You know, like some shit that's not available in your local vape shop or online. Like I done gave a motherfucker. Uh, that's 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 a honestly a, 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 a idea for anybody owning a vape shop. If you are selling, if you have a vape a vape cafe, 
where you have blends that are not available nowhere else, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Like, now you are 100% kind of like catering to your area, Mm -hmm. you know, but you can do online sales with it, you know, but you have to have those blends created, you know, and then boom, this is just the only place that you can purchase it. Now you are centralizing those sales, but oh well, like, you know what I'm saying? People gonna come there because they gonna wanna try that shit. How much they want for it over there, Zero? How much they want for it? Probably like fifty dollars a motherfucking bottle. I bullshit you not. If I go over there and I get that shit, oh, you can be fucked up tonight. You gonna see? <laughs> no, this is um, this one ain't got the melatonin in it. These are actually hundred percent full spectrum. Okay. Mm-hmm. No, that was good. I ain't got. It. I don't even want to do now. I gotta be vibrant. I gotta be awake. We about to get <laughs> bad with you today. I got shit else to do. Man, look here. I got in that motherfucker. I was whooping ass. I was tearing asses down. Okay, so I went from three and twenty six to being twenty six and three out of this motherfucker. That's what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? Like the numbers most definitely did a dramatic change. I had to most definitely switch my gun up and all that good little shit. I had to put in some work to get that gun where it is right now. I just bit. I uh, most definitely um on the main thing about it. Okay, I was into uh, w- what's the name of that joint? Battlefield. I was in my mm-hmm. battlefield hard. I still love my battlefield. I think Battlefield Six is coming out next and shit. It better not be you no know, dumbass shit, man. It better not be no <laughs> dumbass shit. Like space in, you know, on the fucking Mars and you know You already know that's what's gonna happen, man. It better not do that dumbass shit, man. I like just regular fucking gun, you know, AK 47s and shit like that out here, you know, but y'all gotta do the extra shit. Oh uh premium oak bro is like 42 to normal. Um it's like 45. I ain't lot to like dang that ain't bad. For you to want to have that shit like right now on this bitch, and I don't think that that place probably had the premium. Thing for. Forty-five bucks for what? Forty-two dollars for the uh, premium oak barrel of uh, Dead Man's Hands. Shit, sure. ain't gonna bullshit you, cause that right there is again a blend that I take that trip for and gonna get. That. Is that with the code or without? <clears throat> that ain't no code. <laughs> ain't no yeah. code. In a code. Oh, but they got a normal. The normal version is thirty five dollars, but the premium uh, Oak Barrel one, which is what I would go for, is forty two. Yeah, I'm saying, but don't you have the coupon code? Fuck no. Uh, no. Oh. <laughs> Hell no, nah. foolish sin ain't working up in that bitch, my friend. They want the whole fucking retail price. I'm gonna go over there. You know a guy named Zero Cool on this thing right here, here on Instagram. <laughs> He said, he said, I can use his veterans discount. He said, <laughs> hey, I'm trying to tell you, man, like, yo, that shit is, nah, that ain't me played with. It's most, for well, those that had it, man, it most definitely is different. It most definitely is different. Again, it's not for everyone. But if you are alcoholic, then you'll like that shit. <laughs> Way more than that fucking Bogan Brew bullshit. You'll like that shit for being an alcoholic way more than that Bogan Brew shit. I can guarantee, I guarantee, oh my gosh, it is it's most definitely worth you re wicking me, you re, you know, cleaning off your coils the next day and all that good shit. It's worth it. It's worth it. Like, yo, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. Man, you can get in, like, you know, getting drunk and shit, vaping off that shit. You be like, man, like, this is good shit. You should have had that last night. <clears throat> <laughs> Mm-hmm. Oh shit! He got that Hellcat out of this bitch. <laughs> From Dolomite. <laughs> hey, what's another joint that um? Damn man, it was another joint that I uh. Oh, it was a cheesecake blend that I bet you a lot of people ain't tried out. It was off the record. It was off the record. It was available at premium vape. It's no longer available at premium vape. But that shit was fire. Well, what the fuck was it? Off the record. Oh. <laughs> I know, right? Kind of fucked it up off the record. You know, I can't tell you what it is. But off the record is this. That's the name of it. Off the record. Was it just straight cheesecake? 
it was a strawberry cheesecake, but it was one of the best cheesecake blends on the fucking market. I bullshit you not. That was one. I even said that in the fucking review. That was one of the best fucking cheesecakes. But now another one that I had was uh, hey, cool. oh he shit, he is look at him. <laughs> oh, yeah, I gotta five. remember what that number was on the side of the milk carton. Hey, hey, cuz I know that him. now that you got a new car, you get home faster. <laughs> I, was, I was about to make a trip up. Sometimes. Yeah, I was up the hey. Oh, man. Man, what up, fool? What up, boo? What up, fish fry, man? What's going on? What's up, man? What's going down, man? You holding it down, molded bread? <laughs> I don't know what. Mold on the bread. Mold on the bread, man. You holding it down. You know what I'm saying? You don't mold oh. on the bread. Yeah. You might you might try to cut it off, but it's still that taste is still there. <laughs> mold on the bread. Where's my damn light at, yo? I think I gotta get that premium over though, man. Like, I don't even know how far it is. What's going on, Poop? Oh, Poop is a friend for this motherfucker, man. I'm gonna do this at eight o'clock down to the 300 and can this motherfucker. He ain't been around a while. You know what I'm saying? Give him extra money. We're going to eight o'clock. We're going to eight o'clock. We got, we got an hour. We got a four hour for the money and the power. What you over there, Mom? Where are you Hey, you still at the babe shop? On oh, Sundays. Okay. <laughs> they only catch you on Sunday, huh? Man, that's it, man. I know they make a whole lot of sales on Sunday. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> hey, has y'all's business been affected over the past month? Yes. Yeah, same here. Yes, without a without a fucking doubt. Fucked up. Like you yeah. can't even what? like try to sugarcoat this shit. Like it's definitely definitely been a change. Sales have been down shit, probably shit, month and a half. Yeah. Since all the shit started. Yeah. About probably yeah, down to about a month and a half. The, the, I don't want to cut y'all. We can get right back to it real quick. The other cheesecake was called Stonewall. It was called Stonewall. I don't know who the fuck made it, but it was a cheesecake blend called Stonewall. It was at a vape shop. Somebody had sent me that shit. While we talking about this vape shit real quick, I'm going to see if I can find, if I can find it. Hold on. So um, what, what what made your sales go down? Shit, oh. All of this controversy with the with the vaping, you know what I'm saying? With the vaping. What do you think? What, you think? what did it? What is <laughs> They got motherfuckers literally terrified, bro. Like, because they already was on the on the edge about vaping anyway, you know. And this shit just kind of pushed. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's motherfuckers are still like they they know they don't want to fuck with the cigarettes, but they they don't want to die either. <laughs> this motherfuckers being put out there, they don't want to fucking die because they fucking vaping. So you know. And and people coming in, you know, expressing their concerns and everything. But I mean, you bro, know. we've had people actually wanting to like coming in with bags of all their equipment, trying to just give it back to us. They don't want their money back; they just want to get rid of it. Yeah, giveaway time. <laughs> shit, <laughs> team, you shit. What up, zero? <laughs> what up, pokey gang? Shit. Hey yo, okay. Now I gotta order this shit. I gotta order it to make sure this is the fucking blend. But it says uh, cloudy collabs. Cloudy co- cloudy collab. Yup, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. It's called um, Stonewall Cheesecake. I typed in Google Stonewall Cheesecake. Hey, hey man, Ricky's stupid as hell. What about you said I got people doing dope telling me I'm going to die from vaping. Yeah, man. Motherfucker sitting outside smoking. You still talking about something. Hey, ain't people dying from that? Bitch, what? <laughs> you would... Yo, these people don't even see what, they don't even understand what they're saying out their mouths. You know, yeah. come on, yo. <laughs> Same motherfucker sitting here that saw me vaping for five fucking years, coming in there every fucking day with all my goddamn fingertips talking about something. Ain't them things blowing up on people? <laughs> yeah, for the motherfuckers that don't know what they're doing. Some stupid motherfuckers that want to try shit before they, you know what I'm saying, know what they're doing and shit. Nah, huh. nah, nah. Want to go ahead and put a, uh, want to do a Batman build 
on some on some shit they ain't gonna be doing it on out here. What up, Zero Cool? This is he. I am him. Do that right there, real quick. One with the you going up to the uh, to the rally on the ninth, right? Yeah. What? Okay. What kind of rally is that? The one that's too far away for us okay. motherfuckers in Tennessee to go to. <laughs> I'm there. And it's crazy because I took all Friday, so uh, I'm there Saturday. Yeah. yeah. I'm there. And the funniest part about it. I'm going to drive down right to my job and park my job and walk down to the ride. Right. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm, I'm a couple of feet away from that motherfucker. When we walking past the Trump building like this, hey, I'm on my way to your rally, bitch. I'm coming out of the seat real quick. Trump going to come outside. I said it was not about the actual vapes. I said it was about the THC. Now nah, fuck that. You done already said the shit. You got shit started out this bitch. You need to you need to do a week of, of promoting vaping. That's what the fuck you need to do. How many years does he have left in office? Uh, next year's election. Yeah. So I'm trying to figure out why they're still trying to work in pieces, motherfucker. Like, you know what I'm saying? Last next year's the last year. Well, no, nah, he's he's got another term he can run for. He can run for another four and, years. We gonna see how many motherfuckers actually vote for that. I think he you know he ain't gonna get that next year. If hey. that, hey, cuz man, look here. First, you already they they been somebody. You know, it's kind of funny because that's just you know a motherfucker's job. So this motherfucker sitting over there got the job, and they just been sitting over here trying to push this goddamn impeachment for how fucking long? Mm-hmm. You know, you know what I'm saying? Man, come on now. How many fucking battles have they done them for? For the allegations of shit since that motherfucker got in goddamn office. And y'all can't impeach this motherfucker yet. Y'all ain't found no grounds. Goddamn, that motherfucker in 24, his ass was gone with his ass about to be gone in two days. <laughs> shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, goddamn. And y'all- My thing is, is you got him on the Republican side and then the Democrats are fighting like a bunch of children. And then you got both sides at each other. Where, when are we going to get some fucking leadership that'll step up and do the right shit? Not focus ninety eight percent of their time on fighting the other side. Yo, trying to make some shit yo, happen. Yo, to be honest, let me tell you right now, the world is so chaotic right now with that motherfucker in office. Say, so cuz, can you feel the drug test smoking CBD flower? That's the guy you need to talk to. Highly possible. You've got to be careful. Bro. It's all about how much flour you're using, too. Um, and it's like the THCA percentages uh, can, can cause some issues. But yeah, um, go ahead and plan on it, making your tests positive. Just say that. If, if, you, take a, if, you, take a te- if you take a piss test, don't fuck with the CBD. <laughs> I said this shit like six months ago, man. Motherfuckers arguing me that goddamn thing, man. Look, you can have as much isolate and broad spectrum product as you want, but full yeah. spectrum, you, you run the risk. It's yeah. just, it, it all depends on body. Like Foolish, yeah. for example, uh, he could drink the shit by the gallon in full spectrum. He wouldn't, he got such a high metabolism, he ain't got to worry about it. But us bigger folks, uh, yeah. Well, I ain't got to worry about it anyway. All my piss coming back there. Well, we are. Yeah. What? <laughs> you see my oh, face? That goddamn yeah. thing when I kept coming back, she was like, something's wrong. I said, yeah, nah. <laughs> you have a problem, sir. <laughs> but with moderate use of the flour, you can, if I'm talking like maybe one, you know, joint or blunt a week, if that's your thing, maybe once every couple of days, maybe. Hey. But, he got the Boston Empire. And I uh, definitely, I, I, and Boop, I, I would he definitely. He said I was smoking Boston Empire. Who's got it? The dude that just asked the question. Hey, Boston Empire's got some fire. Yeah, they got fire. Yeah. I've seen yours. I got, well, I got the new new coming and wait for that. <laughs> hey, but Are yeah, man, that right there might give you a little bit of a, uh, it says a point, it should say point three THC on that motherfucker, huh? Point three below, but. Which is very, very minute, but 
Yeah, that but like he shit. said, it depends on how you're using that shit too, bro. You smoking that shit every fucking day. Hey, I want to say this: uh, <laughs> save that paperwork, save that hemp, save that CBD paperwork. That they don't care about that shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> I know they don't, but hey, man, like you know, at least if things go down, you know what I'm saying? Like yep. if anything. Well, when at least you, you have some test, sort of argument, I guess. They gonna right, that's you. some sort of argument, but at least when you go and take your test, you know, like, that will be an initial test for you to know if how things are going to go. I think the threshold for um, your analysis is 50 micrograms to fail. So, I mean, if you're, if you're under that 50 micrograms, but you still have it in your system – they're going to be able to tell whether you've been burning the real stuff for the other. You know, yeah. Hey, you're... so, um, hold on real quick. Let me see. Uh, they are X, they are X, hold on. They are X meds have a side effect of death. That's okay. Hold on. That was another. That was another that was, I think that was another subject. But hold on real quick. Move. Have you had the flower from Savage Mods? I don't think you had flower from Savage Mods. Savage who? Savage mods. They have flour. That's what that's what girl food just asks. Oh, uh, listen, listen. Here's my whole thing, right? If a vape company that makes mods, which is what it sounds like, Savage Mods, I, I wouldn't buy flour from someone that's making vape devices. Personally, I'm gonna go. I purchase and I get my stuff from Farm Direct companies. For the most part. Yeah, I bought I some of the best weed in the, the world the from a crackhead farm. looking motherfucker behind the restaurant. Yeah, my sister. That was way less legit than a mod company. <laughs> hey, man, these mod companies are making Wait, wait, wait. And, wait, wait. and that was in Memphis, too, boo. He said they harvest their own. <laughs> behind the Logan Steakhouse and Wolf Chase parking lot. Yeah, I know that guy. This guy said, true story, true story, true motherfucking story. Shit happened. <laughs> Try to tell you how he, he was wearing a black tan leather jacket. He was hot as shit that day. I talked about that guy a couple years ago. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Hey, yo, man. Hey, I, where's my son? Hold up. I got to uh, to tell me a lot of her patients use CBD, and it doesn't help. There. But I also get tested by the Fed, so I'm not risking it. Yeah, man. If you got, you know what I'm saying? You got shit you gotta take care of, man. Don't even it ain't it doesn't make sense to even fuck around with this shit, man. Yeah. I mean, That's if you good. want to use the isolate or broad spectrum, you'd be fine. But anything past that, don't do it. Anything past that, don't do it. Don't nope. do it. I know what I will be doing. Bang, 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 bang. You can't enjoy enjoys nice hemp flowers. Now, now, hey, 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 would you would you agree with me on this? Now, uh, it's been my it's been my experience with you know trying the different CBDs. The full spectrum would be similar to like say like if I if I rolled a blunt of the, the full spectrum, right? That would be similar to me smoking like. A regular blunt, right? Versus, about, versus, about, versus really? not necessarily like. So hold on, hear me out. Versus me using the other, right? Right. Where it doesn't like so like to me, it doesn't affect me the it doesn't affect me the same way. It's right. it's 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 uh it's more like a prolonged or like not not prolonged is not the word. It takes longer. So like for me, I would use the regular, just the regular CBD as as like you would like a type of medicine type. Like yeah. how to prescribe you, you know, take this pill twice a day for, you know what I'm saying? How, however long versus like the full spectrum where you could just, you know what I'm saying? Like if you need that shit right then, like you it's, fucking it's, like- Well, yeah, like with me, like the flower, like flower is full spectrum. So yeah, um, for me, if like, well, everybody that's in the group already knows it's in the Zoom and stuff. Like it's, you know, I start my day with it, and I use it. I usually go like in the morning time. I use it a bunch, but the middle of the day I have a little bit more, and then at night time I have some more. So, um, in the in between those, especially when I'm at, at work, um, 
I use a lot of the actual full spectrum oils or even broad spectrum tinctures and stuff. Yeah. To kind of keep me going. Yeah. Um, and that keeps me level because I'm. Yeah. <laughs> and download Roblox. How about you go Roblox in there somewhere? I don't know where's my phone. I'm on, I'm on YouTube. Yeah. But do we have a computer? Awesome. You got to beat the shit out of it. <laughs> Take back to the hey point. Roman, you ain't lied, man. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know about that, bro. I don't think that shit's going nowhere, bro. They ain't gonna, they ain't gonna fuck with the flower, bro. They, they not gonna fuck. Hey, with well, it. hang on, you talking about the hip flower? They making too much money. No, making hang on, money, bro. On. So right, right now, this is another thing. Um, right now, the USDA um, is is putting their foot in the hemp stuff. Um, you're about to see some crazy shit go down with that as well. No different than them attacking the vape stuff. Um, next week, um, I'm putting some things together for a live show. Um, we can do it. Right? Well, we'll talk about that on here, but... Um, there's going to be a couple live shows that I'm helping set up and we're going to have farmers and hemp farm company owners discussing what's fixing the change in the market. Uh, the USDA is attempting to put into place um, some screwed up things. So normally when farms harvest, they harvest and then they dry their product, then they send it out for testing. Right. Um, and during the drying process, the THC levels will go down enough to where they can reach that 0.3% or below. Um, the USDA is starting to require uh, farmers to harvest and test like four weeks, or no, they're supposed to test four weeks before harvest, which would put the THC level way up here. Um, and then it wouldn't be considered legal. It doesn't make any sense. But just wait, uh, I'll have more information. I've been talking uh, to other companies today um, Get some more details, so stay tuned for that bullshit. Motherfuckers. Yeah. They're, they're, also gonna, they're also going to stop it from letting companies use third-party testing facilities and actually have to go through DEA-authorized testing. Places. Damn. Yeah. Well, Which, look, it's, there's check. two sides to it, so it actually makes it more... It makes it a safer product on one side of it, but then on the other side, that's going to take some money. It's gonna it's gonna knock out all the small mom and pops operations. So, it's and just then fun. check this out. From what I've heard, that the budget cuts and everything to the uh, people that check your like chicken and pork and beef and stuff like that at the slaughterhouses, they're yeah. fixing to deregulate that to where they can hire the people inside the plants to check that shit before it goes out. Instead yeah. of the uh, what was it USDA that checks that shit. So now, you, you know, if somebody inside the plant's checking it, they're going to pass a lot more sketchy shit because they're going to be trying to make money for the plant. Right. That third party keeps it more honest. Appreciate that, uh, Sarush. Appreciate that, man. I, hey, I'm, I'm working on it, man. I'm working on it. Now he's working on that goddamn car. He's trying to get a new car. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hey man, leave me hey, alone, man. It's gonna say straight Mr. 300. That's all it's gonna say. Hey, leave me alone, man. That's I'm working on some shit, man. Work on it. Hey, you supposed to be the first buy that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? The first ride out and everything with that motherfucker. Man, I got the videos, cuz I got the hey, videos. That, I got that the one you sent me was badass. Cuz I, I got like like, that shit. I got like I don't know how many videos I got, cuz it's just <laughs> And now, is that your buddies that's got the custom grill at the bottom and shit? Yeah. On the yeah. front. Man, a, that um, shit looks Here's a, um, the the 2019s come like that, except he uh he swapped out to the uh, scat pack, the new scat pack, and he has got the snorkels, the actual snorkels on there for the uh, mm -hmm. for the air intake. Uh, but yeah, those, those come like that with the hood. The 2019s come like that with the hood. No, nah, nah, right. I'm talking about down on the bumper grill, how it's got the blue stripe. Oh yeah! Dash. Oh yeah! Yeah yeah! He put that on there. That shit looks good. Yeah, I don't care for this shit though. Are really? you really? Oh. I don't. I don't. I I don't know, man. I'm more like 
I don't know. I just don't. I didn't. I didn't really like it. And like it, it matches, but it doesn't match. Like it's it's very very close to the color. Oh, like when it's in the light, like, it looks different. Right? Yeah, it, it's not the exact color. It's it's more just like a sky blue. Now the mm. the the paint on that car actually does change. It does like kind of got because it's a pearl, so it does mm. like kind of switch. But I would have to get. I, I don't like. It's got to be like the exact same fucking thing for me. So, yeah. Hold on. Did you see the new car I just got? Uh uh-uh. uh. You ain't following Foolish. You ain't following Foolish. I am following. Motherfucker. <laughs> you were the queen that got the second. <laughs> I what see you saw it then. You saw it then. I see you post that motherfucking Jeep. I purchase I purchased a new car every week because it ain't nothing new to me. You know what I'm saying? Everything's oh, sweet. Man. Hey man, hey, it, it ain't. Might go get that new Honda Civic next week. You don't never know, baby. You know? <laughs> got that new hatchback coming out. Got that new hatchback coming out. So you ain't even come back with the hatchback. He's been, he's been shopping in the Hot Wheels section at Walmart. Don't let him fucking go. <laughs> let me lay it, cuz. Let me lay it. <laughs> So, Voop, is all flower full spectrum? Absolutely. I mean, it should be. I mean, it's fucking yeah, full I, mean, I haven't like, seen I don't think you can make no isolate, you know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> that's a hell of a goddamn chemist right there. That motherfucker right there. <laughs> what you doing. I'm going to tell you, I seen that video you did, Foolish, uh, that, uh, the one with the rose, the um, the rose, the rose colors and shit. Yeah. Are you talking about this bullshit? <laughs> we had some shit like that in the shop that were just like pre-roll, like pre-roll blunts. Yeah. Man, I hit that motherfucker, man. I'm like, this shit tastes like lavender. <laughs> 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 like fucking, bro, I, bro, that shit did not do anything, bro. Like nothing. I And then I looked at that shit, I was like, man, that shit gotta be like some lavender and chamomile. Or something. Half <laughs> water at nighttime. Now the dude actually chimed in, and I, I was hope you know, like to be honest with you, I was hoping that someone would chime in and let me know whether or not if this was something that has been done before. If people is doing if is people doing this shit, and he was like yeah, sometimes them dude chimed on the video and said yeah, um, that's it's it's not ro- smoking rose petals. Does not hurt your lungs. It's a video up of someone doing it. Man, look here. I said in my video, if you are, if you want to chime in and say that it's okay for you to do this shit, you can suck my well, not suck my dick, but yeah, you can suck the dick because you know, like I'm not doing that shit. You know, like what the fuck? No. no. So you can tell me, I'm gonna take my primo, my smelling good ass shit, and add some rose pet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to add rose petals to stretch my shit out. For real. Now, nah. I can see the... I, I've had pre-rolls before that had lavender added to it just for an extra aromatic effect, I guess. Well, but well, rose petals, I don't... But like not. Nah, but see, none of no, he told Boot because the packaging says no THC yeah. that it has rose petals and the rose petals interact with the CBD and remove the rest of the TAC from that's it. what that's what I was told from them and I was just like start scratching my head I'm like <laughs> nope I smoked <laughs> one I smoked one and then I, was, I smoked and I was like what the f- this is weird and I there's a couple <laughs> other folks that got the same shit box you know full of stuff which some of the products I love I love all right. the melatonin stuff because at nighttime I can take any of the form of the CBDs with the melatonin and within 30 Ooh. minutes my ass Ready to go straight to fucking bed. Done. Yeah, basically <laughs> potpourri. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you know, you're gonna reach out to on, the, on the stove, man. And how whole house <laughs> now again when these products are you know, like even when I said on the pack, like I just did one for gold line. I just did one for gold line that was sent to me by Sidecast. It doesn't say shit about ingredients on the package. Now that right there was scarce to me because it says no THC, and I'm already just had one that said no THC. And this is what I ran through with that situation, and you don't have anything with your packaging, so I had to break that motherfucker down. You know what I'm saying? I was like, yeah, let me see if anything is up in there, but it was none in there. Now to see none in there, nah, you know, like 
I've known that all TA, all CBD always has at least the 0.3 THC content, yeah, you know, yeah. that are lower. So it has some minute of it. So putting no TAC on this motherfucker is not legit, B. And at the same time, yeah. not having no information on the packaging is not legit also. How the fuck right. is going to have power to it's buy no different, shit? It's no different than um, labeling and marketing, you know, stuff with vape stuff back in the day. I mean, you know... And I think honestly, you know, with this whole thing, with, with the honest, I think that there needs to be a little bit of a honest. I look like just like vape. I think there needs to be a regulation on yeah, this definitely. Because man, like you know, it's, it's literally every fucking way, gas station everywhere. And with that, again, here we the kids are going to get a hold of this shit. It's going to be a whole nother fucking spectacle again. Yeah. And and not only that, anybody can fucking get a box and throw some shit in. You know what I'm saying? Throw some rose petals in a fucking blunt wrapper and sell this. Shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, but no, but with regulations. Oh, <coughs> I want to say this right. When with the regulations of that, I would. Of course, we will all like to have. Um, real research done into it. So if you're saying that you want uh, the testing to be done properly, then, you know, have research done as to how the test should be done properly. Mm -hmm. You know, if this product, when we're, if our product is going to be no TAC, and this is the content level of our TAC, you know, like, we can't, <clears throat> this is our product that we're selling. We're not selling that product that you want us to test. We're selling this product that we tested. You see what I'm saying? So, <laughs> my whole thing like, is like, my bad. Hey man, so like this, and so this is my opinion. I just think everybody just needs to get all their shit from Tegrity Farms, man. <laughs> Bro, I saw the that way. Shirts. That's you know you're good. You know it's you know what I'm saying. You know it's some good shit. Test it, try it and true. Get your shit from there, and you fucking good to go. So I got. But to yo, hey, that CBD, that the hemp tree factor. I ain't gonna lie to you. I I do dig the hemp tree factor. I am, I am, I am glad that I'm in the mix of the shit, and you know what I'm saying. I'm getting the shit in and trying it out. Boop has all man. Boop come to all. If you ain't following Boop on the CBD trip shit, man, like Boop gets all the bomb buds. So like I took two weeks off. I took two weeks off of posting. I posted a video about an hour ago, um, but just wait. Just, just wait. I, I got it all sitting down here. Uh, <laughs> he got all the bomb bugs. I'm like, yo, like. It's like I'll be honest with you. I'm done with the vape stuff on the channel. Like it's it's over. No, for me. So CBD uh, is kind of taking off right now. Anyway, we're going all CBD, and then we're gonna bring in. Music well, stuff. You're still going to be vaping like anyway, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're going to be vaping in the midst of the process. <laughs> but yeah, like that shit, um, the bug that you get, I ain't got none of them. I only had like two farms once, and two farms had some shit like that, but I ain't had nothing since a lot of that shit that he fucking gets. I'm mean, like, big fucking nuts. <laughs> big fucking juicy fucking nuts. This shit is fucking ridiculous. Like, <laughs> yo. Dude. That's some shit I want to break the fuck down. I'm trying to. They got a website, right, Boot? Um, this company, Baker's Ranch. Oh fuck yeah, yeah. And I got the coupon code for fifteen percent off and free delivery. I was. Um, How much? Fifteen percent off and free shipping. Oh yeah, I'm getting a bad pamper. It's Boot fifteen over at Baker's Ranch, but this is a. Uh, this stuff's from a really small company, um, Chemic, Chemic Farms LLC. But like, wait till you see, I get the lens out and shit on the review, but. Hey bro, um, hey, will you bring that lens out of this shit, bro? That shit be fucking epic, dog. <laughs> I'm like, yo, for real. Bro, guess what? I, I broke my lens though. Oh man, you gotta go back to fucking Amazon, bro. Order another one of the motherfuckers. Yeah. I, I already did. I don't know where you got that motherfucker from, but <laughs> see that shit, bro. Fucking hairs on that shit and everything. This is that Baker's Ranch stuff, dude. And it is, I don't know how well it's gonna show up on here, but it is it is nuts. It's nuts. It's sick. 
Sugar's tits. Sugar's tits. What he said, man, you ain't gonna see this. Uh, you ain't gonna believe these nugs. I said that. Yeah, that's that's CBD. Well, like we just got all the harvest. Everybody harvested last month, so. Hold on. Uh, no, no. Let me give you the actual interaction of how things went down. You ain't gonna believe these dogs, bro. Let me see this shit. What's the name of that company, bro? What's the name of that company? Hit me, motherfucker, right, right now. Let's hit him through the Instagram. Hit him through the gram. I'm gonna let him know that I know you too. <laughs> I was on it, man. I still ain't heard back with no motherfuckers. Well, but you can you know, mom. I spent a lot of time researching this, and I've obviously tested out a lot of different shit. And the companies respect my opinion. And that's how it is. It, it, it's good. And I show it the way it needs to be shown. If it's some fucking shit, I don't, I don't put a lot of shitty flour on my channel. Because if I don't receive lab work, I don't receive law enforcement warnings, I don't receive license, you know, a copy of their personal license and shit, you ain't gonna see it. Because it ain't you ain't fucking sending out the right documentation. Like it is. That's real shit. And if you're not sending that shit sealed up, vacuum sealed, properly packaged, fuck off. Don't don't waste my time. Because I don't want to get anybody in trouble. Yeah, a lot of people doing that vacuum seal. I like that too. I like the vacuum seal shit. You know what I'm saying? That was oh, Baker Baker's Ranch sends their shit out in this thick ass fucking stank proof bag. And this is this is legit. That's the way oh, to do it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Like, yeah, Where like, you find like, that shit? Yeah, that's a big ass motherfucking packet. Yeah, damn. Shit. What up, HD? Yeah. What up, HD? Ace Rock. Hey, man, I'm about to say Ace Rock. Don't get too. Man, I ain't had no Ciroc in in a while. I ain't had no Ciroc in quite a while. Hold on, did they? We ain't <laughs> seen it in about three fucking months. We don't know. Gotcha. What you it ain't been that long, man. <laughs> man, that motherfucker disappeared, came back with some little dirt balls on his head. Did this <laughs> <laughs> I mean, being in Maryland, that's got to be far as shit. Oh, Colorado bound. I, I, oh, I got to get up with them. I got to, I'm going to get up with them. I'm going to get up with them. Huh? Huh? It's called Colorado Brown. Colorado Bound. They are in um, Merlin up here. Oh. He said they grow their own. Mm. Well. Yeah. Zero said you got your own strain called Mr. Nice Guy. Hey, your face will match on that motherfucker too, cuz. You know what I'm saying? With nice little hat and all that good little shit. Nah, he got he to put the glasses on. Them Blues Brother glasses he was putting yeah. Hey, I'll be, I'll be honest with you. So um, I had a little bit of, well, so we had a, a Halloween party last night, um, but it's a family friend. They just bought a big fucking 25 acre plot of land about 30 minutes from our house. Um, and uh, we, you might see some real badass shit coming uh, by the middle of next year. And uh, my face is going to be on that shit. So it is. Yeah. Real shit. Yeah. Yeah, make it move. Pounds, bitches. I mean, shit, when when you can pay one hundred and fifty bucks to get a license to grow, like I took one hundred and fifty dollars for one to five acres, and it's you know, consider you know, the more you go, the higher your license is going to be. But I mean, that ain't shit. No, you know, it does cost a lot of money to prep the land and, and get all your other stuff set up. But I mean, one hundred fifty bucks. Let's, let's go. I tell you what, we about to be in a war tonight, baby. Oh my gosh. Are you going to stream that shit tonight or no? I don't think so, man. I got to see. I got to hit him. I like watching you get your ass kicked by them ladies. Oh, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> that motherfucker died like 50 times the other day, man. I'm like, <laughs> it was, I saw something. I got to see if it works, man. I got to see if it works because I'm going to test it. I'm going to test it out when I go. I'm going to test it out when I get off the stream and see if it works. So I got my mixer, my YouTube right here. I got, damn. 
I ain't got no signal in it, but yeah, I got my Wi-Fi right here, so everything kind oh. of do that. So speaking hey, of which, head over to uh, Bape, Bape <laughs> Alexandria. Speaking of Wi-Fi, this should be the last night that I stream out of my car unless I'm sitting in my fucking driveway. Oh shit! Yeah. What happened? This this should be the last night I got to stream out of my car at work. We're getting Wi-Fi at the house, so hey. oh, shit. next week I should be able to stream from the house. Oh shit! So, man. That goddamn car came with that shit, man. And motherfucker, <laughs> <laughs> shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> space age shit, man. Shit got the fucking internet in that motherfucker, man. <laughs> no, nah, it's just 2006 model, man. Um, and probably got one of them hardwired corded phones in the console. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> real, real shit, though. My shit got the internet in it, but I ain't got it. <laughs> 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 Man, that shit, cost, man, bro, that shit like twenty dollars a week. It's damn. It's, you're, it's better, like, you're better off going to get a hotspot from bro. Verizon. Yeah, it's either like twenty dollars a week or like it's like fifty or sixty dollars a month or some shit like that. And I'm like, man, what's the connection what like? Man, for that shit, the connection is good. Okay. Uh, Who is that through? Verizon or AT and T? Uh, I I have no. It's through. It's through. Uh. It's through Dodge. Oh nah, fuck that. I don't even know that. I don't but know. They, it's but it's like like the shit, the shit works very well. My partner got it in his truck. I mean, you know, if you gotta, you know, the shit come in handy if you gotta you he know. got one of them trucks with that big tablet ass no, dash in it. No, he his has just the regular eight, the eight, eight point okay. five inch screen. I have seen the, the newer ones, like the new new motherfuckers yeah. got that, that it. It looked like a Tesla. Like uh those are like the 2019s or 2020s. It's got them big, <coughs> big tablets in the motherfuckers. That shit's nice as fuck too. Yeah. But, so yeah. with the um with that with that uh Wi-Fi install, what does that do? You can you can connect your phone, you can do whatever the fuck you need to do while you you know while you're in the car. Oh, okay. Yeah, you don't have to use your phone, you know what I'm saying? You just you don't have to use use your phone to do whatever it is you need to do. Or like if you're out somewhere, you're traveling, you need to connect to, you know what I'm saying? You need to connect. You don't have service. Like the vehicle still has, the vehicle still has service. So like I could, I, I could definitely see why some people, you know what I'm saying, would opt to do it, but I'm not paying for that shit. <laughs> Can you hook your own high spot up to it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to get my own. <laughs> The five so, fingers say to the face, <laughs> unity. Oh, shit. Well, I know sure. you saw that. Park next to him when you get to work. Now that you mention it, I think I'm bleeding inside my chest. <laughs> I know your ass saw that dolomite, though. What? That dolomite. Which one? <laughs> the Eddie Murphy one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I thought you were talking about that. Um, you know, they did a cartoon. No, I ain't seen the cartoon. Oh man, you gotta see this. <laughs> <laughs> gotta clean my system. Clean that system out, baby. So when I go back and oh shit. Take me. What's cracking, cuz? What up, black? <laughs> hey, who's just uh talking about him? It was on the auto. We were just talking about his ass early. Sandita. Yeah, his chain all shined up. You be ready, cuz. Y'all were calling him by the wrong name for like two fucking years. I know, <laughs> homie, though. You were still rocking with the crew, though, man. You know what I'm saying? Well, shit, I can barely pronounce some of the name of the fucking juices I was getting. Well, it was a given. It was, it was most definitely, you know what I'm saying? Like, it wasn't, it wasn't nothing uh, personal. I thought it wasn't, you know. I think what did he like? He kind of like spelled it out like phonetically in chat one day. Like, like y'all motherfuckers <laughs> say my name wrong one more motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, this, he came in the video chat. He said it's Sunday Otta, bro. Sunday. I wonder if he's putting thumb, thumbs downs on all them videos, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> cool people, man. Cool people. We yeah. going on Sunday Otta. He's yeah, always man. showing love and shit. It's always good. 
Yeah, he got that. Um, he be on the pad and shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, who else is that? Uh, it's only KJ got the uh building one. He's building a bike. I've been saying, uh, oh, you've been saying them goddamn parks. Mm-hmm. I'm waiting for that motherfucker to get done so I can finally see the goddamn outcome. You talking about Link? Nah, um, <laughs> <laughs> I ain't talking about replacing body parts. Hey, hey, cuz Kimmy, Kimmy said that motherfucker look like a pressure washer. <laughs> <laughs> man, Link is great. Dead. Link oh, got him three jobs, man. I don't know. I don't know where the hell Link went to. He hit me up not so long ago in Messenger a couple weeks back. So he's just working. Yeah. He went ahead had surgery and never came back. God damn. Mm. It happens, man. Oh, the fool say he was going to get some. What you say? What you say, motherfucker? You supposed to get some dinosaur bones put in his back or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> he done bought up all the neck braces and crutches from Goodwill. <laughs> they go in there putting some fall down the steps and shit. The floor was wet. The floor was wet. Like life alert shit. Yo, what the fuck I look at? What the fuck? No, at least all right. Man, I want, I've been looking, oh yeah, ooh. My law, my law and order you came back, so you know what I'm saying. Any other oh, and order. You still watching that shit? The new episodes came out. I still ain't. I ain't. I don't. I don't think I've seen an episode of that, bro. Yeah, it's good. Hey, that my old lady and them. They've been watching uh some called nine one one. What's that shit called? Nine one one. Nine one one. It's called nine one one. It's on. It's on Hulu. Yeah, I know. Yeah, they fixing to come out with the uh. 911 Lone Star. It takes place in Austin. Lone Star. Yeah, it's a Texas based one, but it's the yeah. same show. Oh, okay. It's just, you know, a spin off kind of thing. Hold on. So, is it, is, I keep hearing about this show too. I ain't gonna lie to you. I keep hearing about it. Is that good? But it's good, but, uh, um, yeah. Yeah. I didn't, I, they, I came in on them watching it the other, the other day, and the shit's, shit's pretty, it's, it's pretty cool. I mean, like, what Ronda the, Rousey's in it. On uh, the last week that I saw, Ronda Rousey was in it. What is it supposed to be about? A bunch of rescue Just, workers saving yeah. people. Well, that's nice. It's pretty good, but see, I I, I like it because it's not just like all serious shit. Like they got some funny shit mixed in there too. Okay. So like I can, you know what I'm saying? I can I can fuck with it. All right, so that makes you check it out. You say you got some funny shit in it that makes you check it out. Yeah, you know, remind me a little bit out the uh about um what's the name of the bride uh and the family and shit. You know who I'm talking about. Tell me why to watch that whole goddamn series. Nope. It's on Showtime. Nope. Three hundred. You the one that wanted me to watch the goddamn show. I don't know what you're talking about, man. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even think of her name. Uh. What? The girl and the, the the father Frank. What the fuck is that? Oh, uh, shameless. Knock my head off. Shameless. shameless. Yeah, shameless. I was so happy. I got my fucking head off. But yeah, man, that's shameless, boy. Yeah, yeah. Man. See, you said watch shameless. I watched that. I took that out. I took that off. Goddamn shit. Hey, baby. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna try to. Uh, I'm gonna try to get up and see if it works. I'm out. I saw this method today, and I'm gonna see if it, you know what I'm saying, like still work. Matter of fact, I can check something. I, it says something. Hold up. It says, Am I used to? No. That man just posted a dead rabbit V2. Who did? What? Batman, motherfucker. Oh, oh. You know, no, 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 no. There was a, there was a bent. Well, see, I don't even see. I'll have to check this out again once I, um, I'm going to put like I see, I like to see you get your ass kicked. I'll tell you. They be talking about kicking my ass on it too. That other day was just a horrible moment. Very horrible. 
<laughs> Y'all, I might have to jump off here, man. I got to head to the house. That's All right, get fuck on Patrick Swayze. It look like you got a haircut <laughs> over there, man. I can't really tell. I, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold, behind hold tight, you got a little hot, got the army cutter going on over there. Behind. Yeah. Told him get a little that. short this time. Cut, cut the Patrick Swayze off, goddamn. <laughs> I should have kept it. Fuck it, dropped down to 30 degrees. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's cold. It's good seeing you again, 300. Yes, sir. Polish man, boop. you know the number, cuz. Yeah. I'm saying, you know what it is, man. All right, man. Y'all have a good weekend. Nice All right, man. All right. Fuck, yeah. fuck the dead rabbit, V2. <laughs> Damn, cuz. Damn, homie. <laughs> Let me see. I'm gonna find it. been yelling at you for two years to check out Shameless. I know, man. I know. I know. I was way off on that, man. I was busy watching Trailer Park Boys, so you gotta excuse me. You know what I'm saying? Shut the fuck up, Bay's Day. They need to come back with that shit, man. I think it was come back with another season, right? I don't know. I think they did do another season, but shit, they need to do another one. You know, they killed your boy off. Ooh, yeah. yeah, Foolish never listens. No. Well, he doesn't listen initially, but then like a week later, he's like, oh yeah, by the way. <laughs> I did that. All right, so boom, I'm going in, I do that, I see that part. Yeah, so you see, I, I, all right, I'm being paged by the wife. I've got to bounce. All right, back. All right, I'll see you in a moment. I will see y'all later. Everybody right. check. Later, guys. Hey, 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 cuz, what's that camera you've been using, man? I see your shit, you know what I'm saying, with the with the 4K clarity, you know what I'm saying? I've been seeing some shit. Me? No, nah, not you, motherfucker. Oh, damn, yeah. no, I'm fixing to say I got this old ass ten year old iPad. That motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, have a good night. All right, bro. Right, right. This shit, this shit just gave me some whole other goddamn thing, which I don't even think is possible because this shit, man. Like, hey, man, know. did you not hear what the fuck I just said? What? I said, what camera you been using? Oh, I've been seeing your shit. You know what I'm saying? The shits. You know. Like super fucking. I thought you were talking about uh uh boop or something. You guys. Oh wow, motherfucker! You know what the fuck I'm talking about? Um, the Canon. I mean, I'm sorry, the Logitech. No, not this for the videos. Oh, the sarcasm. That's a filter. That is <laughs> Canon. <laughs> My old lady said that's a filter. That ain't no motherfucking filter. It's the Canon G9X. Okay. Yeah, bro. That shit, yo. Yeah, bro. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thanks, Sarcast, too, because you wouldn't have made it possible. Shout out to Sarcast, making shit happen, man. That, that motherfucker dope. Hey, man, I'm like, well, you know what's actually crazy? I can do 4K on my phone, and I just haven't tried it yet. I, I haven't, well, I tried it, but I haven't actually done it yet. I'm going to do that shit, you know. Blah, blah, blah. Actually, I can get the mount, the same mount like this. Does that have a flip up? The, the, does that have a flip up screen? No, nah, not this one. Oh, it's just okay. okay. The next one I'm gonna get has the flip up screen. But with your phone, they have the same man Froto one for yeah. your phones. Yeah. And I like the man Froto's. Those most definitely are nice and stiff and everything. They're pretty nice. You are, all you gotta do is hit this button right here and it just whoo, whoo, And it's so hot. You cannot move that shit. It's not moving nowhere. Like it. I yeah. fucked up the shit. It's okay. I can just come off. I just got my bag on extra batteries came in. My other uh SD cards, I picked them up tomorrow. It was like 20 bucks for like uh five of them or something like that. Came off pretty good in that deal. He says still can't find foolish other channel. Your link takes me to some weird ass shit. What? Hold up. Let me check. I guess they see some shit with the wrong type of one Let me check. Oh, man, what the fuck? Why the fuck is that happening? 
Oh shit, hold up real quick. Oh hell no, nah. hold up. I don't like that. That ain't cool. Event. No, All right, I'm about to head on out, man. I'll just stop it through, man. Show you some love, man. That's a bad man. I'm gonna get up with your ass this week. All right, man. <laughs> hey, I gotta edit this link real quick. Yeah, you need to do that, man. I'm gonna take I don't know questions. why that shit was doing that, man, because I gotta go and fix them motherfuckers. That shit is crazy. God damn it. I don't know how that shit happened. You said some random website. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, I gotta go and fix some motherfuckers. All right, cuz. All right, it's a bet. I know how to get to it, though. I know what I'm doing. Give me one second. Um, hit that. Give me that. That's crazy. Thank you very much for giving me that goddamn information. I did not notice that shit. Copy. Copy. All right. Give me a second. Yeah. I cannot believe that shit. I gotta go and edit all that shit tomorrow. All that shit gotta get edited. All right, so that has been fixed. So now you can find Foolish Motherfucking TV out this bitch. Boom, there you go. Yeah. God damn it. Yeah. Ain't that some shit right there? Ain't that about a bitch? What's going on, Sidecast? Oh, right, so I thought I saw Sidecast. That was just a boot train and shit. God damn it. I can't believe that shit. I get hot too much. Yep. Time to get up out of here, people. If I can, you know what I'm saying, stream this thing, I will post this, you know what I'm saying, put the stream up and everything. If I can't, I'll try it again tomorrow, man. But I'm most definitely appreciate everybody for coming through, kicking it with the goddamn dude. Um, you do know my two places to go to for my e-juices and all that good little shit. I got the link down below this bitch. The coupon code right now, a lot of time, I mean, I'm sorry. The coupon code right now for e-juice vapor has been disabled because they got like, you know what I'm saying, their own little sale going on right now. So until that's like officially over, then my coupon code will go back active. But my coupon code is active 100% over there at Premium Vape Supply out this bitch and Premium CBD Supply out this bitch. So most definitely got to give you the information out of here and shit. I will see you guys pretty soon because I most definitely got some information coming to you on the Smart RP40, um, the Fetch kit. The Smart V-Burl out this bitch. And uh, yeah, some juices and shit. Oh, and I even got these like steep bees and the pretzel bees, all that good little shit, you know what I'm saying? We'll talk about it in, in this peppermint with a pretzel. I don't know what the fuck I'm in store for, but you know, you're going to see that in the goddamn video because I will be recording that shit, you know? So I'm going to get up out of here. I will see you guys a little bit later on. I did get a little shit. Thank you guys again for tuning in. I'm out of this segment.